Israel's military proposed a plan for evacuating civilians from areas of fighting in Gaza after Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu announced that a ground invasion of the Palestinian territory's southern city of Rafah was necessary. Foreign governments and aid organizations have repeatedly expressed fears that an invasion of Rafah would inflict mass civilian casualties. More than 1.4 million Palestinians have converged on the last Gazan city, untouched by Israel's ground troops. Rafah is the entry point for desperately needed aid brought in via neighboring Egypt. A statement by Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu's office said Israel's military presented the war cabinet with a plan for evacuating the population from areas of fighting in the Gaza Strip and with the upcoming operational plan. The statement did not give any details about how or where the civilians would be moved. The announcement comes after Egyptian, Qatari and U.S. experts met in Doha for talks also attended by Israeli and Hamas representatives, the latest effort to secure a truce before the Muslim holy month of Ramadan. Israel's Ally the United States said ongoing mediation efforts produced an understanding towards a ceasefire and hostage release, while a Hamas source said the group insisted on the withdrawal of Israeli forces.